as opposed to say, you know, illegal surveillance versus something that the, the surveillance uh, that the uh, 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 government should have been doing. Uh, and he said that's going to be now what he looks into is whether or not that should have happened. But it's, it's uh, remarkable. Two people who were there uh, at the time, uh, Corey Lewandowski and David Bossy, uh, their remarks. He asked the president about this some time ago, and he said it very clearly. He believes this went all the way to the top of the previous administration. This didn't stop at Ben Rhodes mm -hmm. or some other low-level underling. Barack Obama knew about this. He authorized it. It was either complicit or implicit in it, and there has to be accountability. And I'm happy Attorney General Barr is digging into this. Corey Lewandowski is happy. Millions and millions, tens of millions of Americans are happy. Uh, your thoughts about the, the attorney general's announcement that this will, we will now have an investigation. I think most of us have probably the look on our face that uh, Senator Shaheen had on her face when he said that. She said, you don't think that, the, you're not saying he was spied on. And that's when the attorney general said, oh, yes, I do. There was this look on her face, you know, as though she'd been frozen in amber for the last two years. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, like there's gambling in Rick's Cafe, right? Yes, we, we, now it's being said, but the timing is important. After everything we've experienced, yeah. the attorney general saying that bluntly, and we know that it was a hoax, and we know that everything the was... The special counsel the, investigation. The, you know, the, the, yes, the dossier and all of that. And it, it seems to be, even though we, I don't like what's happened over these last two years, it, Gen, uh, Attorney General Barr, I think, is the perfect person to be doing this. It is important. It is a little frightening. But we I'm must just thankful that it. he's there now. I have to tell yes. you, I, that's all that matters to me. It is it, that we are at the right place at the right time. It's a shame we had to go through this. It's horrible that it has occurred. But my goodness, no. people who did this should be punished. We must face it or it will happen again. The president is correct. This should never, ever again be allowed to happen in this country. You know, and one of the reasons that he is so uh, insistent is this president understands he is one of the few people uh, men, women, you name it, uh, no matter what background, uh, any, any characteristic you want to apply. I honestly don't believe another single American could have stood in his place and withstood this fuselage, this barrage, this constant every day and from every direction assault. Uh, like he did and uh, emerged from it even stronger. And the fact that he did has highlighted also how sloppy they were, how arrogant they were, and how dumb they were. This is a new era. I take a different message. I think it shows how strong he is. Well, yeah, well, just by the juxtaposition. But Americans must realize that it's not just Donald Trump. The fact is he's representing all of us. This was an assault on the American oh, people, hell, people, not just on Mr. Trump. And uh, thank goodness he's uh, sitting there in that old office now. Amen. Yeah. Tammy Bruce, great to have you here. Thanks. Thank you, sir. Up next.